Hey, what's going on, Nordic dude? Oh, a dragon? Uh. Hey, what's going on, Nordic over here? And uh, we're on part 11 of uh, this series, and I'm getting attacked by a dragon. Yay, me. The freaking Adventures of Mr. Cuddles. I freaking try to start an episode here. And a freaking dragon comes down out of nowhere and starts attacking the Winterhold. Uh, how am I gonna fight this thing? Pain. I actually burnt that dragon pretty good, actually. I need to lure him out of this city. Out of Winterhold. Dragon. I think Frost drains my stamina. Come on down. I thought he was about to fall like a man. Yeah. Take that, you foul beast. I am too strong for low level dragons like yourself now. Way too powerful. That's what I am. I am the absolute. Two. da da rock. This is the resting place of Iskramor and its most trusted generals. You should be cautious. Kodlak was right. I let vengeance rule my heart. I regret nothing of what we did at Driftshade. I can't go any further with my mind fogged or my heart grieved. Return Wuthra to Iskramor. It should open the way. All right, then. And I need to equip back my glass. Battle X of Justice.
something has shifted in the moons, brother. Sack. What was that? Well, I there you are. Oh, no. I still oh, no. sense your presence. any further, shield brother. Ever since Dustman's cairn, the big crawly ones have been too much for me. Everyone has his weakness, and this one is mine. I'm not proud, but I will stay back with Vilkas. Give my regards to Ysgrimor. I think that's just unfortunate. This should be. Don't go in there. Kill him. Something has shifted in the moons, brother. Yeah. 
you hear something? No hides from the dead. Never. The endless sleep comes for us. Greeting, shield brother. Of course, my fellow harbingers and I have been warming ourselves here, trying to evade Husey. You see only me because your heart knows only me as the companion's leader. I'd wager old Vignar could see half a dozen of my predecessors. And I see them all. The ones in Sovereign the ones trapped with me in Husey's realm. And they all see you. You've brought honor to the name of the Companions. We won't soon forget it. Did he now? I can only hope. You still have the Witch's heads. Excellent. Throw one of them into the fire. It will release their magic. For me, at least. And so slain the beast inside of me. I thank you for this gift. The other Harbingers remain trapped by Hearsay. Perhaps from Sovngarde, the heroes of old can join me in their rescue. The harrowing of the hunting grounds. It would be a battle of such triumph. And perhaps someday you'll join us in that battle. But for today, return to your vessel. Triumph in your victory, and lead the Companions to further glory. Did I hear right? Did he say you were to lead the Companions? You've earned the right. Your strength and honor are apparent to all. And it's my honor to be first to address you as Harbinger. Let's go tell the others. Yay. I am now the leader of the Companions. Bow down before your great leader. Something has shifted in the moon, his brother. You're someone who can get things done. Let's not waste any time. Yeah, I mean, you should I'm carry some here. of my cramp. What do you need to take?
Vilkas said you're the new Kodlak. I don't know what that means, but you seem honorable, so that's good. He's not a werewolf anymore? Even dead? This is a good thing. All right, then. May the gods watch over your battles, friend. Yes, you brought honor to him, even after his death. A worthy outcome for a worthy warrior. If you had told me a few months ago that some outsider I had never heard of would lead the Companions, I might have slit your throat. But I've seen what you can do, and heard of the love that Kodlak had for you. The trust. Let's hope you can show that his heart was not deceived. Good luck, my friend. Well, thank you, sir. I appreciate it. Not right now. I'm going to look at some of these carvings. I wonder if Ysgramor ever set foot here while he was alive. But you don't have to stay if you don't want to. I'll see you back at the Orbasker. Stories to tell the others, eh? I. Skior says that I have the strength of Ysgramor. It's a Nordic rune, thousands of years old. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we did it. I am now the leader of the Companions. We're only 22 minutes in, too. Oh, did you look at that? Still got some more stuff to do. Uh, this episode might be me trying to find where I can start building a house. Cause I tell you, I'm starting to get up there. Kind of would like to have my own place to call home. As my legend grows. Let's get going. Lead on then. I'm still here. What do you need to take? Lead on then. Store all the stuff that I don't need from now. I think it's about time that I uh, see what my magic skills can do. Maybe? Maybe it's too early. I don't know yet. Might go to the College of Winterhold. Or, technically, Could go, uh, could either finish this campaign or choose a side in the when war. When the Empire surrendered to the old Mary Dominion, they shamed us You've all. You stopped. What is it? Friends like you are hard to find. We Grey Maids have been feuding with the Battle Boards for years. There's no more what bitter enemy than an old me? friend. I can. It might save your life. Mm -hmm. Done talking anyway. We've stopped. What is it? I'm heading home if you need me.
Yes. All right, so now I'm gonna go ahead and could go ahead and pick a side in this world. I'll we'll level one more. Seventeen. Actually, yeah, I want to see what happens if we pick a side in this war and then do certain things that have to involve the main story. You're the best, mister. Oh, thank you. Divines, bless your kind heart. You're lucky. You're, you're, you're lucky. You're, you're welcome, Lucia. Mm -hmm. Stay safe. These kids always look at a dead Do you body. get to the Cloud District very often? Oh, what am I saying? Of course you don't. Oh, what happened? You know what? It's about time we picked a side in this fight. I don't need no freaking marker. Um, move it. Picking a sign, picking a sign. That is what we're about to do is pick a sign. And I'm going with the side with the voice. The rebels, the small guy, the storm cloaks. They might be pleased to have someone of my caliber. Heard they're reforming the Dawn Guard. Vampire hunters or something in the old fort near Riften. Hey, they're performing the Dawn Guard. Oh, women. Am I right or what? You come here where you're not wanted. You eat our food, you pollute our city with your stink, and you refuse to help the storm cloaks. We haven't taken a side because it's not our fight. Hey, maybe the reason these Grayskins don't help in the war is because they're Imperial spies. Imperial spies? You can't be serious. Maybe we'll pay you a visit tonight, little spy. We got ways of finding out what you really are. Oh. Do you hate the Dark Elves? Are you here to bully us and tell us to leave? You've come to the wrong city, then. Windhelm's a haven of prejudice and narrow Hello, thinking. No Unworthy of one way such way as me. Why are we even going to a wedding this far flung end of the Empire anyway? I told you it's the wedding of Nothing Victoria new Vici, there. Most of the well Nords living in Windhelm don't care much for us, but Rolf is the worst by far. He likes to get drunk and walk around the Grey Quarter yelling insults at us in the small hours of the morning. Oh, a real charm of that one. Some of these Nords will come up with any excuse to despise us. And it isn't just the Dark Elves they hate. They make a target of the Argonians as well. In fact, just about anyone who isn't a Nord is fair game for their bullying. Huh. Safe travels. See, now I came here to join the Stormcloaks, but I, uh... A dark elf just told me how uh, unfairly these people be treating them. Man, I don't know. I don't know now. I don't know what to do now. Should I really join the Stormcloaks? Housing of racist Nords. I might join the I might join the Empire to be honest. I don't know, kind of a difficult choice. Kinda a difficult choice indeed. You you a dark elf lover? Get out of our city, you filthy piece of trash. Don't like it? Too bad. This is our city. Ours! Don't think I can take you? One hundred septums say I can punch you back where you came from. All right. 
fists only. None of that magic stuff either. Let's go. Come on. Right, let's go, let's boy. Try to go. Try to go. Try to go. <laughs> That's what I thought, you racist piece of trash. Get up. Wanna attack me? Get up. Get up. You wanna brawl? You wanna brawl in the streets like, like you're a tough guy? Get up. Or should I grab my axe and just cut you down where you stand? That wasn't a fair swing. Yeah. Here. Well, looks like I'm going to solitude. Bam, 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 bam. Racist trash. Being old's not so bad. Daughter keeps me fed. My working days are done. They all garbage, is what they are. All of them. A whole lot of them. Garbage. Where's Wooth right at? Anyway. Hard like white man has been laid to rest, I know. May his soul live forever in the halls of Sovereign God. See, and I come to freaking. I come here, and I get recognized you're for being a companion. You're the harbinger, stranger, of the companions. It is my honor to stand before you. Got to thinking. Maybe I'm the dragonborn, and I just don't know it yet. You're definitely not. Yard! I need to ask you to stop. That. shouting is making people nervous. Can't say I've heard of any yeah, too bad. Whatever that is you're doing. But I'll lock you up if I have to. I've got my eye on you. And until I start leading you. I'm telling you, Ulfric's planning an attack on Whiterun. He'd be insane to try. He doesn't have the men. That's not what my scouts report, sir. Every day more join his cause. Riften, Dawnstar, and Winterhold support Are my him. men now giving free reign to anyone who wanders into the castle? Do you have some reason to be here, citizen? Have we? Oh, oh, of course. You were at Helgen. One of the prisoners, if I recall correctly. Hmm, I suppose that's true. Fine. Why don't you have a chat with Legate Ricca? I suspect we might have use for someone resourceful like you. Not many survived Helgen. Besides, I'm sure your being imprisoned was all a terrible misunderstanding. It's not a cause. It's a rebellion. Call it whatever you like, General. The man's oh, no, I kind of hate both away. sides of the army. Jarl Balgruf. Balgruf refuses the Legion's right to garrison troops in his city. On the other... Oh, I need a second opinion. A hey, second opinion, are you still alive? He also refuses to acknowledge Ulfric's claim. Well, if he wants to stand outside the protection of the Empire, fine. Let Ulfric pillage You survived city. Helgen? General Tullius told me what happened. Not many made it out alive. I've got a good feeling about you, and I don't often get good feelings about anything. A warrior knows to trust her gut. I'm not going to go through the normal process with you. I've got a little test lined up. Pass that, and we'll talk about you joining the Legion. General. You people and your damn Jarls. Sir, you can't force a Nord to accept help he hasn't asked for. If Ulfric's making a move for Whiterun, then we need to be there to stop him. You're Draft another letter for the usual platitude, but this time share some of your intelligence regarding Ulfric's plan. Man, I don't even know. Well, I mean, to be honest, I am the Thane of Whiterun, so I mean, like... 
I don't think I've done anything Stormcloak wise. Neither attempt to freak it. Embellish if you have to. Are you ready to test yourself we'll at Fort Horogstad? Like the ancients built many of the fortresses that dot the landscape of Skyrim. Sadly, most have fallen into disrepair, and nearly all have been overrun with bandits or other vagabonds. Fort Horogstad is one of the few that remains mostly intact. We're going to install a garrison there, but first, you're going to clean out the bandits that have moved in. Neat. Good, that's what I want to hear. Now go make it happen, soldier. Yes, sir. I will, I guess. You Nords and your bloody sense of honor. Sir. I don't abide fancy clothes, but you look like you might. I hear Radiant Raymond has a large selection. Stay out of trouble, Khajiit. What's going on with you? Whoa. What's going on with you? Try to fight, bro? I'll show you a real fight. Alright, show me. You know what? Um, I'll, I'll. Wait. Put me on my freaking sword. No, I don't want to do this either. God, I have so many defense mechanisms. You puny weakly. Come here. Ooh. Did I indulge you in your little fight? What you planned on? He must have just wanted to die. Which I don't even know how I killed him by just kneeing him in the gut and throwing him over my shoulder. I don't see how a man dies from that. Must have been terminally ill. Over your valuables, or I'll gut you like a fish. Huh? <laughs> of course, I've seen you at the flagon. My mistake. Good luck out there. Tack need something. Huh. Ain't that something? This is what happens when you uh, use your resources, ladies and gentlemen. You get stopped by a thief, you can just say, hey, fellow Thieves Guild member, chill out, bro. He's like, oh yeah, I remember you. You know I'm a leader. I don't know where, I don't know how you'd even get that mixed up. Fort, you're a gibby jagan. Never should have come here. If you have to, you gotta do it before I get to you. Otherwise, you're dead. Now you'll pay. Nope, too late. You can kill me faster now. Who else wants a taste of my fury? Well, all of you keep missing your arrows. Oh, it's actually cool that you know that snow. Goodbye. Die 
die already, so I can take a stop. <laughs> we are right. <wrong. laughs> <laughs> Oh, isn't that a sad death for a sad human being? Lucky I feel bad for you. Go. Fly away, be free. Yeah. Like the view, sir? Would you like to go over? Humans. Oh. Ow. Minor healing. With Ruth Rad, I shall claim all who try to oppose me. Time to end this little game. You'll need to do better than that. Fight is me. You'll pay for that. This guy is strong. Good night. Jeez. Clobbering me in the next week. Really strong human is what he is. This way. Apparently, there's more to clear out, so I'm not done yet. Well. I don't know much of these places, are they? Not even a little bit. Alright, there's more. Cheese. Gotta get that cheese. Uh, 
Anybody down here? Not a person locked out. Right. Yeah. Who's that? Some dude out here. What's up? I e snare you won't leave here alive. Oh lord. Another really strong one. I don't know about all this dude. Maybe I can disarm him. Too powerful to disarm. Did I just decapitate this man with a hammer? What's the point of a shout if it doesn't work? Eh. You tested me, lady. Great. I took out a bunch of bandits. Two powerful ones, a chief and a bandit with a name. I don't know what that was all about. I didn't like it. A man had a whole first and last name, and he nearly one-shotted me. New in town, Moot chose the king. What is it? We're backing Ellis. Welcome back, soldier. I'm glad you made it in one piece. I'll send men to garrison the fort right away. You did well. I'm impressed. But before we go any further, it's time for you to officially join the Legion. Speak with General Tullius. He'll administer the oath. In joining the Legion, you'll be taking an oath binding you to the service of the Emperor, and thus to every citizen of the Empire. Are you prepared to make that commitment? Well then, repeat after me. Upon my honor, I do swear undying loyalty to the Emperor, Titus Mead II. Upon my honor, I do swear undying loyalty to the Emperor, Titus Mead II. And unwavering obedience to the officers of his great empire. And the unwavering obedience to the officers and his great empire. May those above judge me, and those below take me if I fail in my duty. May those above judge me and those below take me if I fail in my duty. Long live the Emperor, long live the Empire. Long live the Emperor and long live the Empire. Welcome to the Imperial Legion, soldier. Just remember, we take care of our own. Once you're in the Legion, you're in it for life. Speak to Baron. He's normally out by the forge. He'll get you outfitted. Now, if I'm not mistaken, Legate Ricca has a special assignment for you. Don't you Nords put any stock in your own- Welcome to the Legion, Auxiliary. Listen up. We're backing Elisif. When the moot meets, they'll do the sensible thing. Not everyone's agreed to the moot. You've been here long enough to know that Nords aren't always sensible. We follow our heart. Welcome to the Legion, Auxiliary. Listen up. Ulfric's right-hand man, Galmar Stonefist, has located what he believes is the final resting place of the Jagged Crown. We're going to make sure he doesn't get his hands on it. The rest of my men are already assembling outside Corvinjun. I'll meet you there as soon as I finish up here. Cool. Don't so what? Ulfric Get gets this crown and then suddenly ready. he's High King? Again. No, it's... I'm telling you, I heard it. Howling. Those werewolf tales are true. Now I remember. You're the new member of the Companions. The Divines saved me from the streets, and they can save you from your trials as well. Seems there's no end to- Yep. I just have one question for you. Light, medium, or heavy?
Eh, hold on, I'm gonna save it here. Turn any... Yep. I just have one question. Light? Medium? All right. This here is enough to keep your insides from spilling out. Except from the fiercest of blows. And shouldn't weigh you down too much. Now that's it. One free outfit per soldier. You lose that, or get it banged up. You'll need to pay like everyone else. Yeah, do I even want to lick the pipe though? I like the shield. That's medium. Not really much of medium, I right? think. Hey. Reload back. Wait. What the? Oh, I thought I saved it. Oh, yeah, dude. Yep. I just. Light, medium. They don't make finer steel anywhere else. If this doesn't keep you from dying, nothing will. Now that's it. One free outfit per soldier. You lose that, or get it banged up. You'll need to pay like everyone else. What's the situation? Stormcloaks were already camped out around the entrance when we got here. They don't know we're here yet, though. Well, that's something, at least. Looks like the damned rebels got here first. No matter. We have the element of surprise. Prepare to move out. Follow me. Listen up, Legionnaires. Those Stormcloaks are here for the same reason we are. Ulfric, the Pretender, wants that crown, but we're not going to let him have it. I realize some of you may know men on the other side, but remember this. They are the enemy now and will not hesitate to end your lives either. General Tullius is counting on us to bring back the Jagged Crown, and that's exactly what we're going to do. Let's show these rebels what real soldiers look like. Send Ulfric my regards. Whoosh! Well done. They never knew what hit them. But don't underestimate the Stormcloaks. Many are Legion veterans. They may be traitors, but they know how to fight. We had the advantage of surprise this time, but don't expect it to last. Let's move out. This Two battle. Watch it. We charge on my signal. Time to show what you're really made of. For the Empire! Whoosh! Call yourself a warrior? 
You two, stay and guard the entrance. We don't want any Stormcloak reinforcements taking us by surprise. Everyone else, with me. I don't like the look of this. Perfect spot. Ten to one. There isn't any. Let's not jump to conclusions. The Legion always finds it. I'd rather take a moment and look at it than walk blindly into an ambush. See if you can find another way through. We'll charge in to help us. And what a ground. is that? Is this what killed that storm cloak over there? Can't be. Looks like it's been dead for a hundred years. Steady now. The Legion has faced down worse than a few dusty old bone walkers. We're not leaving here until we get what we came for. Now let's keep moving. You guys ever seen a Draugr before? What's wrong with y'all? You ever explored a cave? Your sheltered lives. And this must be the Hall of Stories. Oh, I've heard of this. These walls are supposed to show the history of the ancients who built this place. Too bad we can't read these carvings. Who knows what's... Perhaps we'd uncover. One thing at a time, soldier. Focus on our primary mission. Ebony Claw. Uh, wolf, butterfly, dragon. We're searching for the crown. Hmm, what is that? Some kind of stone claw? I wonder what it's used for.
job. Yeah, it was a bit of an adventure before I came to join you guys. All right, Legionnaires, spread out and see what we've got. Auxiliary, do what you do best. See if you can find some way to get that gate open. Take care of one. Let's see where this leads. Yeah, we took care of one and one of you already died. Guys, you're awful. The crown should be around here somewhere. Spread out and keep your eyes open. The crown should be around here somewhere. Spread out and keep your eyes open. Go deliver the crown to General Tullius.
By holding on to Falkreath, we control access to... Excellent work, soldier. I have to admit, I had my doubts it even existed. Did you run into any trouble? That's not for you to decide, soldier. I wouldn't have sent you in the first place if it wasn't going to be worth it. Now then. I need someone I can trust to deliver a message of great import to Jarl Valgruf of Whiterun. We have it on good authority that Ulfric has raised enough men to attack the city of Whiterun. Jarl, however, refuses the Legion's support. This missive should convince him. Be aware, soldier. These documents contain sensitive intelligence for the Jarl's eyes only. Anyway, now. You have your orders, soldier. You know, they, they I'm made the rap I heard it. Howling. Those. To be honest, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna open this letter and see what's in it. He said it's only for the Jarl's eyes. Well, guess what? I'm reading it anyway. May the gods watch over your battles, friend. No doubt requesting to garrison his men in my castle. How many times must I deny him? Well, out with it. I see. Give the papers to my steward. Don't be daft. Proventus is my eyes. Just give me the letter. I presume once I have it, I can do as I please with it? Good. Hmm. These are interesting reports. Proventus, what do you make of all this? If Ulfric were to attack Whiterun... As in all things, Lord, caution. I urge us to wait and see. Pray wait. I'm of a mind with Ireleth. It's time to act. You plan to march on Windhelm? I'm not a fool, Proventus. I mean, it's time to challenge Ulfric to face me as a man. Or to declare his intentions. He'll do no such thing. He was rather straightforward with Torig. Torig? He simply walked up to the boy and murdered him. That boy was High King of Skyrim. I'm not the High King, but neither am I a boy. If Ulfric wants to challenge my rule in the old way, let him. Though I suspect he'll prefer to send his storm cloaks to do it for him. True. He's already proven his personal strength. Now he seeks to prove his armies. Then might I urge you to consider General Tullius's request? I mean, if you are bent on offending Jarl Ulfric. Ulfric is the one who has offended. <clears throat> but Proventus has a point. Ulfric has made it clear. In his mind, to refuse his claim is to side with the Empire. And what harm is there in letting a few legionnaires die in place of your own men? It seems cowardly. Was it cowardly, then, to accept the White Gold Concordat? This again? That was different. Was I given a chance to object to the terms of the treaty? No. The Jarls weren't asked. We were told. And we had to like it. The chests of gold didn't hurt. Damn it! This isn't about gold! It's time to decide. Lord, wait. Let us see if Ulfric is serious. Oh, he's serious. But so am I. Finally. You there, I have a message for you to deliver to our friend, the esteemed Jarl of Windhelm. Deliver this axe to Ulfric Stormcloak. True, he's a dangerous and bloodthirsty man, but he's also a Nord. 
that honors our traditions. Keep your wits about you and you won't be harmed. And then get back here. Because if Ulfric isn't bluffing, I'll need every able body to defend Whiterun. As always, if you uh, enjoyed what you saw today, be sure to smash that like button. Uh, tell your friends. Share around with all of your beloved family. And uh, subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll talk to you in the next one.